guys. I'm about to cry. First off, good morning. Second off, look at this. Look at it. Oh, so I just got out of the gym and I fasted through all the workout and all that stuff. That's not unusual, but usually I have food that I make myself afterwards. And so I prepare a lot of food because I'm usually starving, but I didn't this time. So I went up to Nick and I challenged him. I said, let's see if you can fill me up. And that's what he made. So we have house made, it's house made flatbread. We have ham, chorizo and egg, some sriracha mayo, chicken on top, pickled onions, I believe. And I want to say this is a cabbage, but I'm not, I'm not a hundred percent on the purple pinky things, but I know I like them. Look at all of that food. Seriously, I am overwhelmed with excitement. So I'll see you guys in a second. Oh my God, that is delicious. Like homemade whole grain flatbread. Uh. Oh, yes, please. It's got such a whole, complete and total flavor with the pickled onions and the sriracha mayo, plus with the egg yolk. All three of those mixed together with that, the chicken and oh, the ham and the bread. It, it's just so good that I have not found the right collection of words. Just come into Coastal Coffee Roasters order some food because you know it's going to be astounding. Everything there is delicious. Lost the challenge, but won the eating because I got full. He filled me up and it was absolutely delicious. For a second I thought I was gonna get him. So I was almost finished. And I was thinking I could eat more because it was so good. But by the time I actually finished the last bite off the plate, I could take in no more. Speak of the devil. Oh, oh, there you are. Oh. The completion date. Ryan's in the studio. And Wade! All of the people! I've been working a lot this morning trying to get things done because Wade and I are going to do a little R&D downtown in a little bit, you know, research and development. So, wrapping everything up, we'll probably head out here pretty soon. I may film, may not. Actually, what you should do is keep up with our Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, and Snapchat. That way you can see all of the adventures. Look for Baitcast Studio on all of them except the Snapchat. Over? Because they don't let me mean? change it. What? Good morning! Whew. February, right? So a lot of things I had to get done before February or get done to release on February, like the Coastal's new menu and what they're offering. And also the newsletter for February coming up for Coastal. So we were troubleshooting printing all morning. Then I had to ship off a package for House on Gifts. So I was running to the post office and of course, you know, the post office was stood in line forever. I really am considering stamps.com. It's just no expense, so maybe. Maybe not, who knows? Because standing in line, infuriating and a waste, and it needs to be more efficient. So, sometimes you just gotta pay for those things. Anyways, just got back, finally ready to eat some food. The drinks I had last night, and the fried chicken and tots, although delicious, and not in an excess, but together, made my stomach unhappy. So, I've been taking it easy all morning. I haven't had but a few sips of coffee. I've been drinking a lot of water. Just kind of trying to wait it out a little bit. Just ate a banana. Should be good. You don't need to know what I've been eating. Yep. I've got a few more design things that I'm gonna pump out real quick. While I was eating all those delicious things and destroying my stomach, we were also brainstorming and coming up with some super exciting plants. Like seriously, we, we came up with some great ideas, but we're about to do some cool things with you guys. And I hope you're excited as we are. But for now, I need to get these things done, so we'll catch up with you soon. Oh, and we got something in the mail! Mail time! Seriously though, and I'm excited because I need these. Of course I'm excited. I'm always excited, right? I mean, shh. First try.
<laughs> nice. New business cards. Nice. They feel great. Right on, Vistaprint. Right on. And Whitney dropped off my Christmas presents. <laughs> right. How awesome. And look at that. It's an old linoleum cutter. That's so cool. I love the design right here. It's a really neat logo. Plus, look at that. <laughs> it's so neat. The whole typography and layout of this is just fantastic. It's nice. So thank you, Whitney. You rock. All right. Back to work. So I did not do a lot of recording today which I kind of realize now as I film the goodbye that I'm going to do. I pretty much just sat in front of my computer and knocked out a bunch of designs right after the next and then I took a break to eat food and then Ryan came here and then... But it was productive, we got a lot of things done. I'm just happy. Which is happy, I don't know. Clearly my head is frazzled and I need to go home. So I am. But you know, to do more work, just at home. Bye. <laughs> This feels so much different than any other time that I've done a video. Oh, but it looks so much better. You're gonna like it. <laughs> All right, um, hey, I don't know what to say to you, but guess what we're doing? We're, we're block printing hats. As you can see, we kind of went through a test run earlier. But we are putting together our dad hats for Bake Hat Studio and we figured why not share the block printing process and how we're kind of brainstorming and working our way through printing on hats. So this is good, now I can like find different camera angles and things. Really good. So right now, I've got it cupped under like this and I'm pushing down to try and apply an even pressure. The color pops. Can we answer that? Hello? 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 I can't hear what you're saying. I'm sorry. I'm sorry if you're recording. I'm the worst. Add Candy the Baked Cat logo. Here's Whitney. <laughs> oh no, you're in the video! Alright, let's get started. You got some over here. <laughs> I like that. Me too. Oh wait, it's supposed to go in the middle. <laughs> <laughs> that was awesome. You look like you were calling to your native. <laughs> I <laughs> Stop flexing, Caleb. <laughs> You're recording all of this? Well, we're also doing weekly vlogs now, so it kind of counts. Mm -hmm. So, That's dope. instead of doing daily vlogs, I'm just going to sum up a week. Save myself time and frustration. Alright, guys, we'll check out. Okay. <laughs> Go ahead, do your like, do you want, Oh, no, no, no. Do you, you want to do that no, for no, real no. or what? No, not for real, not for real, because no. I'm not trying to do that right now. This is Whitney! <laughs> what was that? What sound effect noise I know, that was did you choose to go with? <laughs> that was like bridal music. <laughs> I, was, I know. <laughs> I was trying to do entry old music. <laughs> <laughs> oh, like a, like a Queen of England kind of Yeah, thing? like the in. Yeah, yeah. I only got the first two horns, and you guys judge my song. <laughs> and the last final detail touch is to put it on the back. Put it back. We killed it today. This is your Monday update. It's been fantastic. 
we pretty much spent all day making jokes, making how-tos, creating content. It's been dope. So you guys have a great Monday. Bye-bye. What's up, everybody? Seriously, how's it going? How you doing? It's weird not doing these videos like every single minute of every day that I'm here. So I'm trying to do these weekly vlog wrap-ups. So I'm trying to pop in and say hello because it's Tuesday and I haven't yet. Um, let's see, I finished the Ninja Turtles painting this morning, which is pretty cool. Next, I've got a design I need to finish for a client. And then I'm going to spend a lot of time editing videos. There are so many videos I have to edit still. So I'm about to bring a sleeping bag. I'm going to camp out here. And we are going to knock these out. Ugh, ouch. So, side note, I made the video for how we were making these hats, which are behind me. So there's that, which is pretty cool. You'll probably see that before you see this. But whatever, that's how things go sometimes in this industry that we call unorganized posting. It's studio life. Tired, sleepy, more than usual. Even though I baked this morning, I'm like, that's, that's pretty common. I didn't even go to the gym. Was, I don't know for sure what it was, but I have my suspicion that it's because I've been have been eating a lot of sweets lately. I've been falling victim to the deliciousness out in the cafe. Kristen. <sighs> it's good. But I think it's I think it's messing with my energy levels and I don't I'm not getting enough sleep. So I'm not as productive, I'm not as focused, I don't like it, so I'm gonna cut back, I'm gonna get more strict, focus on what I'm putting in my body so the energy I have is efficient and sustainable. I'm not doing a roller coaster ra wave, you know, I don't want to crash and take a nap. I'm rambling now, I'm sorry. Anyway, it's just incredible that I was so sleepy and tired that when I sat in that chair, I almost fell asleep. Went to the grocery store, bought food, went home and ate an omelet with chicken and bacon and spinach and onions and then I had some Brussels sprouts and some more bacon. It's, it's so good, delicious. And on the way back here, I, I can feel myself getting energized. You know, it's pumped, just, just ready to go. Seriously, it was incredible. I feel so much better now to work. Just remember to eat and eat, eat well. Old man life pro tip. Also, side side note, look at this. Like I could cut my beard in this way sections my head. I feel like an action figure that is like, like you can pop my head on and off. Eh. So I'm probably gonna have to shave that off so next time you see me it's gonna be gone. Just disappeared. I apparently had a lot to say to you guys. This is a long one. This is gonna keep going. I missed you. It gives me a reason to wake up. I like doing the Instagram story post but I feel it feels better, you know, we are connected more. Somehow. I don't know. I don't know, I'm weird. I'm weird. It's old school. This is just something that I'm comfortable to, I guess. Beats me. But that's enough talking, I think. I think I need to get to work. We've got things to do. This is month two, February. we got to prove ourselves and do better than last month. And we will. January can suck it. I mean, it was a good month, but it's going down.